tolerability is very, very important. This is an older group of men. Uh, the traditional approach would be ADT alone, which men don't like, but they can tolerate and live sometimes for many years with this treatment. So adding about four and a half months of treatment with docetaxel chemotherapy is not a trivial matter. Now that said, uh, the toxicity in general was, was re very reasonable, and I've been using this now for the past two and a half years in my own practice, and I've found that it is difficult for some patients, but really it's mostly neutropenia, fatigue, some uh, fluid ret retention, side effects that we've understood related to docetaxel for many years. So I have made adjustments for older patients. I might start at a lower dose. I might use growth factor if they're particularly at risk for a neutropenia. But I have not had a lot of trouble with, the, with giving this treatment. Um, neutropenia is something that I would focus on. Uh, un unfortunately, it remains an issue, although I wouldn't use prophylactic um, growth factor. Uh, but it, uh, there was also a differential effect in the two studies I mentioned. There was about a 6% rate of uh, febrile neutropenia in the uh, American study, but it was about 12% in the UK study. So we don't fully understand those differences, um, but we're going to continue to monitor this situation.